All right. My husband. My mentor. Hey. My boyfriend. Hey. My sugar in my tea. Oh, yeah, no. hey. My honey. Hey. My syrup. My crown. Hey. Thank you. Thank you. Amen. I thank God for your life. I thank God for bringing you close to me. I know I went for a job. I didn't know that I was going for double things. I thank God. I still can't forget the day I met you. I was like, who is this handsome man? I hope he has not been taken. I changed my step. you notice the step. Wow. Now one thing is for you to change the step. And, that is for you and another thing for you to be noticed. Hey. But he noticed me. Hey. He didn't only just notice me. As he held my hand. And I walked down majestically. And up till now he's still holding my hand. I thank God for your life. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord continue to increase you. I have a lot to say. We're going to put it in the book. We're going to put it in the book. Even when we went through tough time, even when I went through weeping, you stood by me, sir. God bless you, sir. God bless you, sir. For our children, you've been amazing, dad. And you are still doing an amazing job. Thank you so much. I thank God for your life. As a pastor, oh, sometimes I say, God, give me the strength you give to this man. May the Lord continue to increase you in the name of Jesus. Our pastor here. I could remember when I met him. We just gelled. You know, there are people that you meet, you know, you struggle to build a relationship. But when I met him, we just gelled. We talked, we laughed, we cracked jokes. Since then, anytime I'm with him on the, um, you know, over the phone, we're just laughing and one thing I will say about him among many things is that he's real. Very genuine. He will tell you where he stands and you know where he's, he's coming from. You know, and I'm grateful to God for that. And he loved the Lord. He loved the Lord. No matter what, you know that he will continue to serve the Lord. No matter the challenges, the tough times. So his heart for God is, is unquestionable. Pastor, God bless you. Amen. It's good to know you as a friend. Amen. You know, and it's good that we are in this era. And I believe by God's grace we will do great things together. God bless you. Thank you for having me. Thank you. God bless you. you and uh, there's something that stood out which is uh, basically his arrival which is your generosity you know uh, my on behalf of my family we hold you a lot <laughs> because I was just wonder sometimes I said how do you hold pastor's hand because uh, you know it's just to me that there is this connection between both of you because uh, um, I've not seen somebody that's so generous like a pastor. You know, um, I, I I don't, please, one has please. I don't attend the church. Immediately I told pastor that I lost my mom. I was dazed the amount that he gave me. Even the church that I attend, uh, you know, uh, 
it was, uh, I, let me just leave it like that. And uh, all this war has been there for my family and uh, a wrong. And my mother-in-law came and the, the, what she did amazed me. You know, when I grow up, I want to be like him. Because, you know, it, 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 no, I mean, it's a grace. It's a grace. That grace, I convert that grace. And I, I pray the church know this man. He's just open. You know, please stick with him. God bless you, sir. God bless you. Amen. What shall I my husband has said it all. <laughs> I said I wanted to say something. Said you want to go again? Really? Uh, <laughs> I want to say something about my daddy, hey. <laughs> my papa, <Hey. laughs> my foxy, hey. my daddy. Hey. As in, oh, he's really been so good to know you, to be connected to you. You've been helpful. Anytime I call him, that uh, dad, oh yeah, this has happened again. He would just, he's always there to, I mean, to encourage, to advise. You know. And I, anytime I'm with him, I'm so free because he can't say anything and he's always there to hear you and to give you a great advice. So thank you so much, sir. We are so grateful to know you. We are so happy to have you as a father. That's my dad in this country, you know. Yeah. We give God the praise. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Ah, mama. about you. Since I met you, my life has changed. Amen. You have always there for me. In time of trouble and sorrow. For the past two weeks, I'm going through a lot. Inside my, inside my heart. For you are encouraging me. Oh. Everything will be alright. Oh. You are so good to me. Amen. You are my father. You are everything. I don't think I can do without this family. Because I always stand by me. Wow. I thank God for your life. I'm so blessed that I met you. I always thank God that make me to meet you at the point of my need. Amen. And you stood by me. Amen. You found me strong. Amen. You made me so strong in that Lord. Amen. Thank you so much, Pastor. Amen. Mommy, thank you so much. Amen. You know, Pastor, I want to thank God for your life, for you and Prophet his life. And I'm, t I'm thanking God for making me to be part of your ministry. Amen. You know, I've been to so many churches. Amen. But when I first came to your ministry is where I feel accepted. Amen. And I just want to thank God for your life today. And I pray that God will continue to replenish you. Amen. And whatever you lay your hands on. You will prosper. Amen. Whatever grace, the, the grace of God will continue to speak for you and your family. You will never lack anything in this season, Pastor. You have God is about to take you in a new dimension, a new level. The grace will speak for you. Do you remember the word that God showed me on Friday? He said He is about to do a new thing in your life, and it shall spring forth. You are about to go to a new dimension. Everything that you have been praying for, God will settle you in Jesus' name. It is already settled in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Uh, just in one minute, uh, I want to say something by my pastor. He said, brother, is more than pastor to me. What I say by pastor is that you only see, when you are seeing mountain, you don't see the mountain. You only see light outside the tunnel. So anytime I call you, what can I do for you? So I was like, this man, he don't, he just seen it. He said, don't worry, it's, it's, it's possible. So I want to thank you for encouraging me. When I'm not seeing any light, you only show me the light. And I pray that everything that concerns you, your ministry, the Lord will perfect in Jesus' name. Uh, reconciling your children, they will not lack anything good. They will grow from wisdom to wisdom. They will examine among their equals. They will stand tall among their equals. And shall be well with you. You are a blessing to me. I have to confess it. God bless you, sir. Amen. Praise the Lord. I mean, I have so much to talk about, Pastor, exceptionally. 
the things he's done for me and my family, I cannot. I would tell say, you know. you I can't say you know. I cannot <laughs> count it. The man has been there for me and my family. He has loved us, showed us love, even our lowest points. But the exceptional one that really, really, um, that's so dear to my heart. I mean, I've been good with a lot of pastors. I've ministered in many churches. But in the area of my ministry, I have not seen anyone who has touched my ministry the way he has. You know, in my music, he contributed so much. I cannot really tell. So I want to say um, I'm grateful for that. I want to say God bless you um, for using you and uh, to bless me in my ministry. When um, there was a point in the, there was a point before my um, my first single was. Um, about to be released. I was going through these trying times. Man, it was really hard. And um, I, I had to someone courage to come to pastor. I said, look, look at what is happening. And how he helped me, man. If he hadn't helped, I don't think um, it would have been successful now. I want to say God bless you, sir. I really appreciate that. Thank you for that seed you sowed in my ministry. I really appreciate you. May God, I mean, enlarge your course. May your oil never run dry. May you continue to bless the source where that money came from. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you, everyone, for that amazing speeches.